welcome guys in this video i'll be explaining to you how to use this function of whatsapp business called labels labels are absolutely beautiful they are they are important to your business especially when you have truckloads of leads coming to you on a daily basis it is basically ways by which you can segment your customers into various levels at which they have gotten to with you okay so we have um this is this is the default um labels that comes with your with your whatsapp business you can edit it you can delete it you can create a new one and so much more so we have you can add new customers to your label you can add new orders those that just purchased an item from you you can have um, pending payments you can have those who have paid you can have pending deliveries this helps you um this helps you organize so that you don't start looking for one particular customer in the midst of a thousand contacts or even more that you already have so let's go right into my whatsapp and let me put you through on how to get this done okay so this is my whatsapp if you want to um, create a label all you have to do is long press on whichever um, name you want to label i can um, just add a lot of people now and then i will just um, hit the label button and i will add them to the label so if i click on this label button right at the top here immediately i highlighted it that feature opened so i click on it and it will automatically open all my labels these are my labels i told you earlier that you can edit them these are th what i edited mine as okay so um you see add new label here click on add new label and you give it a name okay um, so i can just give it um, test label test label and click on save and this will automatically save once it saves it will appear on this place it's, it will be the last one that will appear okay you can only create 20 labels you can only create 20 whatsapp labels yeah you can see this is the label that we just created now and each label has its own unique color okay so there are ways by which you can edit this label and the likes okay so let's go back and go back so if you want to access your label click on the three dots at the top right corner of your whatsapp then go to labels you click on labels once you click on labels you see all your labels here the sweet thing is that labels are just like um, broadcasts they are broadcast messages okay so if you want to message people that are already on your labels you click on once you click on labels and you get to this place, click on the particular label you want to message, then click on the three dots at the top right corner, then you see message customers. Okay, you see message customers, you can delete the label, you can edit it, you can change the color and the likes. Okay, so if I click on message customer, it will automatically add all those people and I'll click on this green button right here. Once I click on this green button, it should automatically create a broadcast um, list out of this particular contact, out of this particular label. One thing you want to do is whenever you are sending messages to a broadcast list or to a label, please note that your customers are going to receive the message individually. So type a message as if you are talking to just one customer. Okay, type a message as if you are just talking to one particular customer. Okay, and this message is going to deliver to them one by one. So you just um, type in whatever you want to type and click on this green send button. But I don't have anything I want to type right now. So I'll just exit this. So another thing I want you to note is that the best thing for you to do is to respond to your um labels when you send them a broadcast message respond to them one by one because messages <laughs> the response they will give you from the first message that you send to them is absolutely going to be individually different so you have to respond to them one by one that's the best way to go about it okay so i love this particular feature because 
it is less stressful. So you can see that I have um, I have pending um, ad status. If you pay me for WhatsApp status, I'm going to add you here so that I don't forget to post your advert. Uh, if I have an order, if you place an order with me and I haven't delivered it, I'll put your name right here, pending deliveries. So I'll just quickly come here and chat people that I have people that have pending deliveries with me okay so that is it um what else do you need to know about label let me see um let's go to labels again you can actually edit your label like i said so you can click on the three mine three dots and click on edit okay this is edit you just change the name and the likes okay so if you want to remove a customer from one label to another all you have to do is open the label where you want to remove the customer okay so i'll just i'll just open this particular one now it will display very soon my whatsapp is a little bit hanging because of the loads of people that are in here Okay, so these are the 16 people that I have on this list. Another thing you need to take note is if you don't have people's numbers saved, they will not get your messages on this um, broadcast list or in the label. They will not get your messages. So you want to take it as a point of duty to inform your customers that they have to save your number while you have to save theirs too. So let's assume I want to remove somebody from this label. I'll just long press on it and you know just pick the the people that i want to remove or add then i can click on this label function here okay you use this one to add them to another one you use this one to remove them from this particular label okay so the first thing you have to do is click on this um the one that you used to add and add them to another label by clicking on a particular one then once you are done you now come here to remove them from this particular label if you remove them first before adding them you will not find them again so the first thing you have to do is first of all add them to the other one and remove them from the previous one okay so so this would help you uh, move customers from pending orders to delivered or something or from new customers to customers that have placed an order and the like so this is absolutely important so that you can your, your life can be easier okay and this only works on whatsapp business if you don't have whatsapp business it will not work for you one of the reason i'm using this um label you can see i have over ten thousand contacts right here ten thousand nine hundred and fifty nine contacts at the moment okay so if i <laughs> suddenly start looking for just one customer's information i will keep scrolling and scrolling and scrolling if i don't remember the customer's name okay so that is that about that that is how to use your customized labels properly how to create um how to create the label how to edit it and okay let, let me show you how you can delete the label so click on this and go to label hold it down and you see the delete button right here at this place so you can use it to delete um labels remember that you cannot create more than 20 labels so if you have any label that you're not using you can always delete it and create another one okay so that is all about this let me know if you got value in the comment section like share and subscribe to my youtube channel so that you can continue to get awesome videos like this that would help you skyrocket your skill and scale your business to the next level if you have any new thing that you would love to learn about WhatsApp, Instagram, sales and marketing, please drop it in the comment section and I'll do well to create a video on it. See you next time.